Okay, well this is my third generation effort at making the turning target. Uh, it's smaller than the last previous two goes and a bit more refined. If you look back through my past videos you'll see how it's progressed. Uh, on this one we've got uh, power light here to show the uh, circuits on. Lights here to show which program is actually running. The whole thing measures around about uh, nine inches by five and a half by about uh, six, 16 inches. We've got a 12 volt lead acid battery there, rechargeable of course, uh, and the radio transmitter. Uh, we've got six channel uh, radio receiver, 40 amp auto. Uh, relays, uh, indicator for the battery voltage, 12 volt battery voltage, uh, we've got the fuse there which is an ordinary auto blade fuse and then we've got four individual timers preset for various uh, sequences. Here I've set this one for uh, one exposure of two and a half minutes, one exposure of 20 seconds, one exposure of 10 seconds and then five exposures of the seven and three standard pistol sequence. Um, we just plug the actuators in the side, so the cable that runs to the actuator goes in here. The whole thing's operated by a remote control. These are supposed to have something like 200 yard range. I've not tried it at that right distance, but I've tried it at 70 meters and it works absolutely fine. Uh, so we switch the power on, the red light will be on now although you probably can't see it in the sun. As soon as I press the button the targets will turn away and uh, edge away. So press the button, targets edge away for 7 seconds and then they turn and face. I'm running program 4 at the moment. This one. So it will do 5 exposures of 3 seconds face, 7 seconds away, 5 times in a row and then it will stop. When it uh, stops at the end of the program, it'll stop edging away from you and it'll stay away until I press the, the button again to cancel the, the program and it will then face up. It only using actual uh, any amount of current while it's doing the turning, while it's stationary either side there or uh, edged away, it's, it's doing nothing apart from the illuminating the LEDs. So the battery lasts weeks and weeks. Uh, we only have to charge it every couple of months. Um, and uh, this is designed to screw on the wall. It's got a fixing point on the back. And it's done its five circuits, so it'll sit there now. And the only energy it's using is just enough to hold relays in. <coughs> Excuse me. I'll press four and it'll face up ready for scoring. And now it'll sit there burning nothing now, only the LEDs to show the voltage indicators and the LED on there. So, uh, this okay, well, I'll just show you what's inside the actuators. Uh, the actuators are made by uh, timber, 6x1 decking in this case, uh, weigh about uh, 12 pounds, quite substantial. Okay, we've got uh, leads here, they're the four, four meters on a long lead and a little tail and this is so we can link up several actuators, actuators together. Um, inside here we've got uh, a new windscreen wiper motor, you'll see uh, on some of these turning target systems uh, they use a model aeroplane servo motor but they're really not man enough to turn uh, heavy duty targets so we've got a windscreen wiper motor there uh, we've got a switching mechanism here and with the cams we've got a, a detent here so it uh, clicks into place at the 90 degree angle and it's supported by a bearing on the top there with a 12 millimeter shaft uh, 
uh, and that's the actuators uh, you can link up uh, three or four or five together uh, just chain them all up and they all operate from the same controller um, I'll show you how the controller works in a moment Okay, we've got three actuators set up there with uh, three different targets. They're just temporary target frames at the moment to see how it goes. Um, on the left we've got a PL12, which is the 25 uh, meter, 25 yard pistol target. Uh, in the middle is the PL14, which is a 20 yard pistol target. And on the right is the 50 meter PL seven uh, 50 meter free pistol target uh, it's on a plywood backing so it's quite a heavy one and I'll do uh, program 4 which is the 7 and 3 uh, the old UIT dueling system ok so targets away watch and shoot watch and shoot So there's your five uh, five exposures of uh, three seconds, all finished. Now they'll sit there and wait until the uh, range offer decides it's the uh, right time to face them up. So now we're going to face them up and score and patch them. 